Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. And if you're back, mwah, mwah, kisses. My name is Rosie for short. And today I want to share with you my oral hygiene and three ways that you can get white teeth. I'm going to be sharing with you some of the tips that I do to clean my teeth and to prevent bad breath and also some ways that I do to get white teeth. I think I'm doing a good job after my mom and even my boyfriend mentioned that I have white teeth. So I believe I'm on the right track and I want to share with you guys what I have been doing. So without talking anymore, let's begin. Okay, so let's start with the things that might cause our teeth to get stained. So some of those things can be either coffee, tea, and some foods, even pasta with tomato sauce. So personally, I'm not the type of person to drink coffee often. It's something that I never got used to doing, but I do drink coffee every often. Um, I always prefer tea over coffee. I love tea. If you offer me both, then I would definitely pick tea because I love tea so much um but again it's something that i do every often so i think that not drinking coffee on an everyday basis works wonders and how often should you brush your teeth i think that's totally up to you in my case I like brushing my teeth morning and nighttime. I know some people might do it in the afternoon or after every meal, um, but I think it all depends on the foods that you eat. As a vegan, I eat a lot of fruits, veggies, and grains, so it's something that I feel that I don't have a strong breath with those type of foods, but um, maybe if you eat some food that has onion or garlic, then maybe you might want to brush your teeth afterward. But I I don't mind those type of smells because they're veggies and I really like veggies. And of course, really important that when you brush your teeth, don't forget to turn off the faucet. I know that if it's not part of your routine, you might forget to do it because we're, we get so used to doing the way that we do things on a daily basis but i personally never forget to turn off the faucet i don't want to waste water i don't like wasting water so it's something that i suggest that don't forget to turn it off to help the planet and along with that i want to share the type of toothbrush that i use and i always make sure that i use a bamboo toothbrush this is the eco-friendly way to brush your teeth instead of using plastic. Plastic is so bad for planet Earth. So I really like using bamboo and the one that I have has three months here. As a reminder, don't forget. So every three months we should be switching toothbrushes. So mine has July, August and September as a little reminder that I should switch my toothbrush in September so I really like this one but there are so many options out there I buy most of my things on eBay or Amazon because those are things that I normally wouldn't find at the store so yes a bamboo toothbrush is the best way to go okay so as far as the toothpaste that I use at the moment I have Tom's of Maine and I know that some vegans don't like using Tom's of Maine after Colgate the parent company started owning this brand um, but the way that I like to think about it is that I'm gonna give you an example if you go to Walmart they sell a lot of things so even if it's meat fruits and veggies and it's hard to say that I'm not gonna buy from that store only because they sell meat. You still have to go to that store and get other items. So for me, it's kind of the same as long as Tom's of Maine remains cruelty free, then I think 
it's fine to keep buying from them this is the way i think now but who knows maybe later on i might change opinion but as of now i do buy toms of maine but there are other brands that are totally cruelty free and vegan in case you want to pick a different brand so i'm gonna leave a few options in my blog post in case you want to check that out so basically Times of Maine is the one that I use in the morning and then at nighttime I use EcoDent and EcoDent is basically a baking powder tooth powder so I like the name tooth powder but this has baking soda and it has a little bit of mint flavor so I like using this at nighttime because I feel like it's not of a strong taste and then the one that I have now from Tom's of Maine is the Luminous White. This is the first time that I'm trying this brand because the one that I like using that has no fluoride, they didn't have at CVS. So this is the only option that they had. So I went with this. But personally, I never use toothpaste with fluoride because the water already contains that so i don't like using toothpaste that has that as well so um in this case this is the only option that they had so i went with this okay next would be floss again i have tom's of maine i tried this but i have a hard time using just the string so i also have these type and I know it has plastic but I make sure that I don't throw this away in my regular waste basket I always put it to recycle so this is a great way to just floss so um, these are two options but I definitely go with this if there is a better option then let me know because I'm open to trying out new things And the last thing as part of my oral hygiene is this. And in case you're not familiar with this, I shared this in my last video. And basically, this is a tongue scraper. So basically, you just stick out your tongue and you scrape. So this is to get rid of residue and prevent bad breath. And it's a great way to get your tongue clean and make it part of your routine. I like using this a few times a week. It feels like you're massaging your tongue and it feels really good. And I like it. <laughs> Okay, so now three ways to get white teeth. So the first way is oil pulling. And I know a lot of people are familiar with this by now. And basically, it's just basic coconut oil. And at first, I was not sure how to do this, but then I was able to figure it out. And what you do is just grab one tablespoon of coconut oil, put it in your mouth, and just make a motion like if you're rinsing your mouth and you're gonna do this for about 10 to 15 minutes and the first few minutes you don't feel anything but after a while you feel like your face muscles they get tired and it feels a little bit uncomfortable it's not painful but it feels like you just want to stop <laughs> but that's basically all you do and you do it a few times a week in my case i like doing it maybe every two weeks or once a month and it's really important that when you are ready spit out the coconut oil don't do it in the sink but rather on paper towel or toilet paper and throw that away in the trash and you'll be getting white teeth <laughs> okay the next way is using apple cider vinegar and i like doing this when i'm going to drink it so basically what i like doing to give it double use i get a glass of water and then i add a tablespoon of apple cider vinegar i make sure i get organic which is the best kind and then i grab a little bit of that just to rinse my mouth and then the rest i will drink it and that's really good because apple cider vinegar has potassium magnesium and it's naturally acidic which really helps to get rid of bad breath and get rid of any bacteria that you might have in your mouth and also it helps to get beautiful skin if you drink that so i recommend apple cider vinegar and the third way is using simply 
water it with lemon and again i do this when i when i'm going to drink lemon juice and i have been drinking that every few days to get nice skin and to prevent acne but it's something that you can also drink to lose some pounds and basically what you do just get a glass of water i like using filtered water and add the juice of one lime and just grab a little bit of that just to rinse your mouth and then the rest you can drink it i love drinking water with lemon i love how it tastes and it's refreshing and it basically alkalizes your body which is great Okay guys, so that was my oral hygiene routine. I hope that it was helpful and also how to whiten your teeth. Let me know how it works for you and if you want to leave me any comment or question, you can do it in the comment section. And let me know how it goes for you. You can even share with me with the hashtag Linsire on any of my social media pages. I hope you liked this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in the next video. Kisses! Bye! Oh, oh, oh.